What's going on YouTube? Chris back here again with a very special video. So as you guys know, I love Tom McDonald. Dude has been killing it in the music sphere. So <clears throat> basically a lot of people, this is probably one of my most requested video as well. A lot of people are asking me to make this song. It's called My Fans. So basically Tom McDonald, he's like, man, I gotta be honest with you. Like this is one of the greatest songs I've ever heard because, well, I haven't heard it yet, but I'm gonna hear all the all the you know comments told me about it and I kind of just know what's coming he's basically praising his fans you know a lot of these artists and stuff they just talk shit about their fans like oh man fuck my fans I don't need my fans shit guys if it wasn't for your fans you'd have literally this much like I literally love my fans my nearly 2,000 fans that I have I will do anything man like you know what I mean but eventually I'll get back to you guys one day I don't have shit right now so can't really do much but guys like in terms of your fan base, I mean, it's like the biggest thing ever. If you're trying to promote yourself on Instagram, social media, trying to promote a business, you know, hopefully I want to try and do that someday. But guys, literally like, you know, the fans is everything, man. People that support you is huge. So this, this basically gives homage to the fans, you know. Uh, actually, that's not the right word. This basically gives praise to the fans. Um, so we're going to check this video out, guys, and see exactly what Tom McDonald's about. And I'm gonna move this camera a little bit. So hopefully this is a good song, guys. Let's get right into it. Hey, blood don't make you family. I got brothers from different mamas and daddies. I got Dude, as always, man, just right into the video. You know what I mean? Just straight in, man. He doesn't waste no time. He says, Blood doesn't make you family. I got uh brothers from different families. That's facts, guys. I got friends that are just family as well, man. You know, blood doesn't mean shit really. People who would kill for me, I'd kill for them, and we ain't never met. We just say, What up on the internet? Shout out to anyone. <laughs> I love that. Let me go back. People always tell me to give up. He's saying, I, Guys, the people I talk to on the internet, like, literally the best people ever, but you know what I mean? It's really crazy because as you get older, you kind of lose that, you know, you know, in secondary school, so if you might have millions of friends, which I still have a lot of friends, you know, kind of, you know, a little bit. I like, you know, guy friends. I don't really have any girlfriends, but. I have a lot of guy friends and they're all legends, you know what I mean? But um, as you get older, you kind of start to lose that word. <laughs> if you're on the internet, it's kind of crazy. You never feel like without that. It's kind of crazy. You know, that's why I think a lot of people do social media, Instagram stuff, because you, you're constantly connected. You constantly feel like, you know, you have some sort of uh, friends or fan base or whatever, you know what I mean? It's kind of crazy, but, you know, you'll never speak to them ever, but you'll just say what's up on the internet every day or every second day. And it's crazy, man. It's a great feeling, though. <laughs> Hey, blood don't make you family. I got brothers from different mamas and daddies. I got people who would kill for me, I'd kill for them, and we ain't never met. We just say what up on the internet. Shout out to anyone showing love in the comments. Just know I got you to the day they put me down in that coffin. If y'all got problems, bro, every line's every line's I can't even go 20 seconds of the song, man. He says shout out to every, all the cat fans in the comments, man. Shout out to you guys, man. I love you guys too, man. The comments, I love you guys forever, man. I'm in your corner together, we'll solve them. It's like a family reunion when I see y'all at a concert. And my fans have my back. Hate us if your feelings don't like facts. And my fans will fight back. Need you with the keyboard you've been using to write back. And everybody been. Ooh, dude, just the flow in it, bro. This shit is tough, bro. This shit's tough, man. Man, Tommy Dolan's quickly become one of my favorite rappers, man. I don't know how the hell this shit happened, man. It's just cool, like. You know, just has good flow. Um, you know, obviously, dude is. um sometimes talks about controversial topics, stuff like that, which, you know, I don't really talk about politics, I don't really care about that shit, as you guys know, shit's boring as fuck to me, but when he's talking about praising his fans, so people, you guys, I love that, man, you know, you gotta give back to people, always thank the people that kind of brought you to where you were, because if it wasn't for his fans, his, his two million and a half fans, <laughs> subscribers, he'd have nothing, you know, I mean, he'd still have his music and stuff, but, you know, a lot of that stuff is, is, uh, is, Comes from the internet, so. Fans have my back. Hate us if your feelings don't like facts. And my fans will fight back. Need you with the keyboard you've been using to write back. And everybody bitter that we've been doing it bigger. If you're triggered, we ain't tripping. We know you don't get the picture. We are better than ever. We got each other whenever. We need a friend and a bond is thicker than genuine leather. Me and my fans, we don't care what anybody say. Middle fingers to whoever. And Dude, this is like a party song. It's like all American rejects or something. <laughs> Real party song. I love that, man. This is great, man. This is a hot one of those. One of those happy songs. I like I like those happy rap songs too, man. You know, a lot of these songs about killing people and shit. It's kinda like a bit much sometimes. This shit's class. Bigger than genuine leather. Me and my fans, we don't care what anybody say. Middle fingers to whoever in the way, man. Me and my fans, we gon' be together to the grave. The game till forever and a day, man. Me and my fans, we don't even trip with the hate. I don't give a fuck in our fans, man. Me and my fans, we the hangover gang. Gang, 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 gang. Yeah, you guys, 
hangover again, you know what I mean? And I'm well, I'm well used to those hangovers because, you know, living here in Ireland, guys, drink quite a lot every weekend. Um, but I'm trying to cut down on that, guys, to try and, you know, get the, get the gains going and get the fitness, you know, top priority this winter. That's my top priority. You know, I'm killing now every single day in the gym. I've hit all my fitness needs and stuff so far. So just onwards and upwards from here, guys, you know. Uh, Tommy Dunn likes to promote health and well-being as well, guys, as well as, like, you know, fans and stuff. It's really cool to see when I like that kind of shit. It's class. Nothing but love and respect. You might have some cool fans, but mine are the best. We've been through it all. Dude, I like that, man. This is nice, man. Hold up. I totally just muted it there, my bad, guys. You might have some cool fans, but mine are the best. Yeah, We've been yeah. through it all. Went to war when duty called. Never left a man behind. We move as one is super strong. I don't want followers. That implies I'm the leader. I'm not the captain. I just gave them something they can believe in. I hold the lamp in the darkness, but they're the light that I needed to see the road that we walk in between the angels and demons. And my fans have my back. Hate us if your feelings don't like facts. And my fans will fight back. Beat you with the keyboard you've been using to write back. I guess we need each other like both sides of the battery. We the army, we the homies, we the gang. We the cavalry, we're brothers and sisters, we hold it down like we gravity. Can't nobody break the bond that made us all family. Me and my fans, we don't care what anybody say. Bill Fingers. Bro, I'm gonna rewind this a little bit. I love that, man. That last verse was fire, but um guys, when he's talking about um his fans and shit, man, it's really it's really cool to see because like as I said, like not a lot of people talk with their fans at all. Eminem does, so he likes it, he praises his fans. You know, he knows that there'd be nothing without them and stuff, so you know, gives love to them, man. It's pretty cool to see people getting his tattoos and stuff, man. And like his fans are like my fans, man. They're like my greatest man. They just blew up my channel, you know. I went from having like 700 subscribers to nearly 2,000. <laughs> Bro, man, I just love you guys, man. I didn't notice. I didn't know like that five, five, barely five months ago, I'd have 2,000 subscribers on YouTube. Bro, when I started this shit, I had like 70 subscribers. All of a sudden, because of certain rappers, Easy Mill, and certain guys, they just started, you know, for me, blowing up, you know, for me. So I'm. I am just the happiest guy in the world, man. It's, it's crazy, man. Hate us if your feelings don't like facts. And my fans will fight back. Need you with the keyboard you've been using to write back. I guess we need each other like both sides of the battery. We the army, we the homies, we the gang, we the cavalry. We're brothers and sisters, we hold it down like we gravity. Can't nobody break the bond that made us all family. Me and my fans, we don't care what anybody say. Middle fingers to whoever in the way, man. I just want you to know that I really love y'all I'm alive to write this song and that's because of y'all You pulled me out of coffin, you didn't know I was locked And showed me love when I was ready to be done, y'all You saw something in me, I guess you see in yourselves I'm so thankful cause I needed your help The least I can do is try to explain how it felt But I'll never find the words to sum it up very well I just wanna say thanks, I just want you to know If you're holding my hand, I will never let go Beside you I stand, through the rain and the snow If you're hangover gang your home. Me and my fans, we don't care what anybody said. Oh. Middle fingers to whoever. I need, I need to get a tear in my eye. <laughs> Dude, that's fire, man. Dude, that's. I love that, man. You know what I mean? A lot of people forget, like, how they make their money and shit. It's all based on these people buying your merch, buying your, you know, CDs, buying your songs, listening to your music, coming to your concerts. They forget that these people are what make you that person that you are, you know? It's fucking. That's awesome to see, man. So the rest of that, so this song is like 20 minutes long and basically the rest of the whole video is, I can't get into it guys, but the whole video is basically just his fans thanking him and stuff, you know, and you know, imagine having 20 minutes of footage of just your fans thanking him, he's pretty loyal fans man to be honest, like, I love that man, you know, Tom McDonald is something special man, we gotta protect him man, he's a cool dude man, he's a cool dude. When No Life Shack had him on, I was like man, who is this guy man, I was like man, like, like, you know, um, it's just, 
you know, I thought maybe that this guy, I, I, I misjudged this guy like completely, dude. Like, this is actually wicked to see a guy like Tom come out from like nowhere, you know what I mean? Like, he wasn't that big a couple of years ago, now he's absolutely huge, everyone loves him. Basically, yeah, guys, as I said, just go follow him on Facebook, Spotify, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, and uh, yeah, that's basically it, guys. Hangover Gang for life, as always, and love you guys all. Uh, leave in the comments down below what you guys want to see next. Pause this video, go subscribe, or just wait till it's over because it's nearly over. And just hit that subscribe button, guys. And let's stay quiet because we have Airbnb guests. And I'll love you guys forever. Peace out, guys.